Hey guys, we're testing these net bright spotlights from Mr. Beams and I'm kind of excited about this product because it's got a couple components that make it really cool. One is that it's wireless, battery operated. You can attach them anywhere. And then the second one is that it's a, it's a network of lights, as many as you want to get, and they talk to each other. So if the motion detector turns one on, it clicks the other one on. Okay, now this light doesn't, uh, is not going to turn on when it's daylight or when it's light outside. It only activates when it's dark, which is cool because it's not turning on with motion uh, detection and wasting batteries. So I can make it come on if I cover it up. But then when this one comes on, watch what happens to this one up here. You see that there's no, no motion turning it on right there. But I can make this one turn on and it will, with a super slight delay, turn on the other light. Okay, see that? So I knocked off light and make this one dark. It detects some motion and then it turns on the other one in the network. So that's a really cool uh, aspect of this. They did a great job designing these lights. It's not a super bright, but more of a matte finish in this white that we have here. But there's some things that they did in the mounting of it that I really like since I professionally have mounted quite a bit of hardware and I am sometimes wonder what some people have in mind. Okay, one of the things is that you can take this base off and do the mounting with this base with the base only. Now that's really cool because you don't have to work your drill around something to try to get at the right angle for the screws to mount it. You can mount this thing because it's wireless. You don't have to have it hooked up to the grid to electricity. You can mount it on a tree, you can put it on a fence post, take it out to an outbuilding. Uh, somewhere we don't even have power at all you know there's the possibilities are numerous and then the other thing they did on the mounting part which I really like is rather than trying to hide uh, where the screws mount in in any way they're just accessible from the outside and you know it's cor incorporated into design it looks good uh, mounted this way but you can go ahead and situate it run your screws in and then once it's in place, then you can attach the uh, rest of the light into the base unit and tighten it down, and that part of it's done. And then it's got good adjustment uh, pivoting the head this way. So once you have it mounted, if you're going to mount it vertically like this, which will probably be the most common thing on the side of a building or a post or a tree or whatever, then you can point it... Uh, down straight down back a little bit if you want to have highlight type lighting just aim it at whatever you want to and then um, you know just tighten this down so these net bright lights again they come on only when it's dark if one of them detects motion then it tells the rest of the lights in the network to turn on which is really the biggest thing besides them being wireless meaning you can mount them anywhere it's a good design idea and an easy way to get some added security and the convenience of having light maybe somewhere where you don't run power to it. Network is where it gets its name from. Net bright lights from Mr. Beams.